It's the radio guy, Dr. Mike Prince. Welcome to another episode of the Mike Prince Show. It is our mission to bring you news you could use. Today is no exception to that rule. Follow me on Twitter at the Mike Prince Show. The YouTube channel is the Open Mic Broadcast Network, and our website is obnradio.com. And in the event you have one of those smart devices, all you have to do is say, hey, play the latest episode of the Mike Prince Show, and just like that, you'll have everything that you need. And with all that being said, let us jump into today's episode, reminding you of two dates that you need to mark on your calendars. April 29th will be the Panther Club's second annual golf tournament from Pasadena, Texas. More information on how you can support that effort, get in contact with Adam Washington at 832 588-1090. And on May 1st, you need to mark your calendars for the Panther Backers 29th Annual Golf Tournament. Dino Robinson and company willing to take your phone calls and reservations and support for the Panther Backers Annual Golf Tournament. All you need to do is reach out to Dino at 713-417- Two zero nine zero. Now, both of these efforts will go in support of Prairie View Athletics. So be sure to register today to support the Panther Club, the Panther Backers, and Prairie View Athletics. The weekend has arrived upon us, and we'll start with softball. They're scheduled to take on Texas Southern starting today. Panthers are 17-1 and in conference play. Texas Southern coming in with a 6-9 and record. So they'll be trying to make some ground coverage on the Panthers. But the Panthers are full steam ahead. On the baseball side of things, Panthers will be hosting all corn. Now the Panthers are 10 and four in conference play. And in all fairness, when you look at this thing on paper, it would be, let's say unnatural. If the Panthers are not to get a sweep in this weekend's event. Now I know that seems like, a tall order, but all corns baseball program is absolutely struggling as we speak right now. And if the Panthers want to have any substantial game and keeping up with the Grambling State Tigers, they must sweep this game or these games this weekend. And the reason I'm saying that is because Grambling and Southern will be getting together this weekend in a very critical matchup. Now, as we stated, Gramlin is on top in the West. Prairie View's number two. And Texas Southern's number three at eight and four. And Southern is number four, seven and five. So those rain delays, in fact, Southern is behind three games dealing with the Texas teams, two behind Texas Southern and one behind Prairie View as far as rain delays go, so they'll get a chance to make that up. We also discussed that in more detail with our weekend interview with Coach Chris Crenshaw of the Southern Jags on The Zone this coming weekend. Meanwhile, on the eastern side of things, it's pretty much established between Alabama State, FAMU, and Bethune-Cookman, but a very critical uh, series this weekend is going to be Alabama A&M and the Jackson State Tigers. Now, the Jackson State Tigers are number four currently, but right on their heels is Alabama A&M. Now, Alabama A&M took two out of three in their first matchup this season, and so this is going to be a very critical series to determine who holds down that number four spot in the Eastern Division of the Southwestern Athletic Conference baseball standings. So things are mounting up. Things are 
gearing up for the May 24th tournament from Atlanta, Georgia. And the Panthers were definitely planning to be there, just as if you were to go right now, you would have Grambling, Prairie View, Texas Southern Southern from the West, and as we mentioned, Alabama State, Bethune-Cookman, FAMU, either or Jackson or Alabama A&M. So all that will weigh itself out. And speaking of things weighing itself out in HBCU baseball, Black College Nines will be having their selection show on April 26th. That actually be a day before the NFL draft. And it is scheduled for 7 p.m. Eastern Time, I believe, or 6 p.m. Central Standard Time for the selection process of the Black College Nines World Series. So we'll try to keep you informed on that as that develops, all starting on next week. And of course, there are some more spring football games this coming weekend. The University of Arkansas at Pine Bluff will have their black and gold game. And we have scheduled to speak with us with a recap for that. The new head football coach as of December 22nd, Alonzo Hampton. And of course, we'll hear from Coach Bubba McDowell of the Prairie View A&M University Panthers as the purple and gold game will be kicking off at 4 p.m. So if you're going to be near the campus of Prairie View, you got one heck of a weekend coming out. You're going to have some recruits coming. It's going to be the Spring Fest. You got baseball, softball, and football all in one swipe of the day in order to come out and have a great time. I believe there's going to even be some tailgating to help celebrate the spring festivities. Now, with everything that we got working out and going on, we must remind you that we try to come to you each and every day right here from the Open Mic Broadcast Network. And we are so thankful for the support that we get. But if you could do us a favor, subscribe to that YouTube channel. Click the bell notification and you'll keep up with everything that we have going on here from the Open Mic Broadcast Network. Now, the YouTube channel is the Open Mic Broadcast Network. And also, be sure to visit that website at obnradio.com. One more thing we want to remind you, there is a mega football camp coming up on June 1st on the campus of Prairie View A&M University. Now, of course, it's going to feature Coach Bubba McDowell, but it's also going to have Deion Sanders scheduled to be in the house. And all this takes place on June 1st. First, now there'll be other colleges involved. It is called a mega football camp, but you have the likes of Deion Sanders, Bubba McDowell, Texas College, and a couple other colleges that'll be coming up. But we'll get that information out to you just as soon as we can get it turned over. And maybe we'll talk with Coach Bubba McDowell about that camp when we get our recap this coming weekend. I am going to exit stage left for right now. I am the radio guy, Dr. Mike Prince. Don't forget, we try to come to you each and every day right here at the Open Mic Broadcast Network, Monday through Friday. It's the Mike Prince Show. On Saturdays, it is The Zone. And we're just mighty glad to be in that support portal. And until the next time, you guys be blessed. And we'll see you on the other side.